Well, back on the little smart car today. Got a new head gasket. New head bolts. So I'm gonna start blowing these holes out. Clean that surface up. Same on the head. We're gonna go ahead and bolt the head back on it. And I gotta get some more specs on the camshafts, bolts, and then we might put that back on today. A few more things. So let me get started. Y'all get the idea, so let me continue. Well, I've got it all head bolted back on, cams in, tightened up. Now I'm fixing to do the timing chain. Get it lined back up and try to get this part of the motor back on. So I'll pause the film and turn it back on in a minute. Well, I got the chaining all back on. The black teeth to the dot. I don't know if y'all can see it. There's a dot there with the black tooth. One right there. So I'm hoping this that's how I took it apart. I'm hoping it's still in time. It's a lot of work to do if it don't end up now the camera ain't going there. It's a lot of work to do all this and this image not be right. So I'm gonna go on further. Well, most everybody that works on vehicles knows usually when you mess with the exhaust, you break a boat off. So what I've done, I broke the boat off in this. So I took a chisel, chiseled the nut off the bottom. They just had a nut welded on it. So I just chiseled it off. Now I'm gonna put me a bolt with a nut wedged together. I'm gonna tack this nut back on this manifold and that way I can put my heat shield and all that back on like it's supposed to be. So that's just a tip, you know, in case you break one. That's what it was. And I just chiseled that off. 
now we'll forget that back on there. But there it is for tonight. I'm, I'm calling it tonight. I'm kind of got to wait on some intake gasket, exhaust gasket, and thermostat. Or well, thermostat and housing goes in that hole right there. I can start finishing putting this thing back together. Hope it runs. I ain't gonna swear it will. I'm all new to this. It's hard to get repair manuals for these cars. So, that's what I got left to put on, which that won't take long. All that junk. What'll take the longest is putting it back up underneath the car. And all the holes lined up and all that junk. But that's just an update. Where it's at now. When we get some parts, then we'll see what else we can do with it.